Stop holding yourself back, please. So many times I see business owners who don't want to take up space. They don't want to uh, disempower other people. They don't want to uh, appear arrogant. They don't want their ego to get inflated and step into a space that they're not supposed to be in. This is Mark Silver with Heart of Business. And I really want folks to stop doing this, to be willing to step forward. And, you know, it needs to be acknowledged that there is a spiritual truth to not wanting your ego to be inflated, to not wanting to take up too much space, to not um, gather attention to yourself in ways that are unhealthy. However, I saw something happen at a Sufi gathering, maybe 12, 15 years ago at this point, and we were all gathered. My sheikh was visiting from Jerusalem. He was still alive at the time. Um, and uh, he turned to one of the teachers and said, uh, please make the adhan for Dur. And the adhan is the Muslim call to prayer. Dur is the midday prayer. And this teacher didn't even take a breath. He, he was asked to make the adhan and there wasn't even a moment. Make the adhan. Allah! He just, he just like lit right into the adhan. And the adhan, you know, it's like it's allowed. It's a call to prayer. It interrupts the day. It's intended to interrupt the day because it's about calling us back to our hearts, calling us back to our to connection and all the people who were all doing different things that if you were self-conscious or worried about taking up too much space, he just, he just launched into it. And I've held that in my heart all these years because it was such a beautiful transmission of stepping into what you're being asked to do. You're carrying a gift in your heart. Your business is carrying that gift. It's a form of expression. All the people at that Sufi gathering were there voluntarily. They had asked to show up. They knew that we did prayers. <laughs> they knew that the Adhan was coming. When you are in a space in the world and your business is something that you really are in service to the world about, that your work is intended to support people and help people. There are people out there waiting to hear from you. They're waiting for you to call them to connection. Do not mistake the desire for healthy humility with some kind of spiritual directive to be quiet and to not take up space. Humility is about surrender and being guided and being willing to take up the space that you've been given. There is also arrogance in false humility, in staying small when you're being asked to speak up. Make the Adhan. Call your people to you. Take up the space that you've been given. We need you and your gifts. Without you, we are not whole because you are also part of the divine creation. And if you are hidden, something is missing. Where are you holding yourself back? Look in your heart with true humility. Where are you being asked to take up space? Where are you being asked to make the call? Where are you being asked to put your love out into the world?
blessings upon you and your business.